Tasker has some new assistant related features. Check it out. Uh, the, the existing assistant request event had an upgrade and now you can specify some extra filters. So for example, you can specify if an app shares a, a URL or uh, you can specify if the app has some text on the screen and some optional extras as well. So to, for this example, I, I uh, check when the assistant request is made in, while in the app YouTube, and then I check if the request has an URL associated to it, which YouTube usually does, and then depending on if I squeeze my phone or if I long press this button here, it'll do different things. So let's see. So if I open YouTube and long press this button, but if I long, uh, if I squeeze my phone, the video starts playing on my PC. So with the info I get from the assistant request, I get the URL from YouTube and then I can do whatever I want with it. And in this case, I simply send it to my PC with a join send push action. And so now you can get much more info out of your apps with the assistant request. And while this needs a tasker to be your assistant on your phone, there's this other news, new uh, action. There's a new action related to assistant that doesn't require tasker to be your assistant. So if I open tasker and go to tasks and have this get assistant info, info action, which is a new action, it gets all of the same uh, info as before, but on requests. So instead of waiting for the event, you can get the assistant info action, uh, the assistant info anywhere you want. So for example, if I, if I play this here, I get all of the texts on the screen, which in this case are from Tasker itself. And then I can see uh, the JSON, the JSON texts, which in this case uh, for Tasker, they are just simple texts, but for other apps, they might have uh, URLs and other info. So there's a, a full JSON structure available with the info. And then finally, you have the extras, which are also dependent on the app you're in. You're in. For example, in Tasker, you can see that this project is project ID 2, task ID 5, and a bunch of other things. So each app has its own info, and it, it's cool to check out what info is available on each app. So for example, let's go to YouTube again. And if I run this task, first off, it says that it has a URL. So this is the URL for this video. And as I showed before, you can do whatever you want with that. And then it has all of these texts on the screen. And also this, these extras. So it's cool, it, try this out and see on your uh, favorite apps if they offer any useful info and then you can do stuff you want with it. So this is the new um, assistant related event and action. Hope you enjoyed it, bye.